Supalo Yangsuri. A green waterside ecological park where the trees, flowers, and the Bukhangang River flows. Exploring a Supalo where the water is clean and the grass is green. The second story. Today, we're going on another very special ecological exploration. The second location is Supalo Yangsuri. The atmosphere is very different from that of Supalo Unshimri, the first location we went to, right? Yes, there is a wildflower square and a pretty waterway. And the Bukhangang River can even be seen from here. It's quite beautiful. That's right. Supalo Yangsuri is also a special ecological space that was created to save the Hongang River and preserve the ecosystem. Originally, apartment buildings were planned to be built at this location. But the Ministry of Environment and the Han River Basin Environment Office purchased this land and created Supalo Yangsuri instead of constructing buildings. Wow, that's so cool! If apartments were built here, Wastewater, which includes the water from washing up, laundry, and food preparation from the apartments, would flow directly into the river, right? No doubt. If apartments were built here, numerous trees and plants would have had to be cut down, and the animals, such as birds and insects, would have lost their homes. Just thinking about it is very sad, isn't it? What's even more terrifying is that the water from the Hongang River is what people in metropolitan areas consume. It's their drinking water. Something serious would have surely happened. Phew, that's quite fortunate. Since Subalu Yangsuri lies between cities and the river, the wastewater from the cities doesn't directly enter the Hongang River. This space is very precious since it purifies the water. Right. This natural shelter contains abundant grasses and trees, not densely packed concrete buildings. The air has become cleaner, and the beautiful walkways benefit many people, not just the residents. Now, shall we look around Supulo Yangsuri? Mom! On the left! There's a square where children can run and play. And on the right, there's a water course that looks like a snail. I want to play at the snail water course. <laughs> All right, it looks fun. You can find water courses in two locations in Supulo Yangsuri. One of them is the snail water course, where purified water from the Bukhangang River flows from April to October. The water is very clean, right? But don't put your hands in the water. The other is free-flowing water in the center of the park. Okay, shall we go to the forest now? Yes, I'd love to. The forest air is refreshing, and I feel more at ease. Mom, I hear a bird nearby. Oh, it sounds like a song. This preserved Eucomia forest was here before the park was made. And I heard that they hung birdhouses on many trees, such as Retusa fringe and sawleaf zelkova, so that birds can rest. That probably explains the continuous bird song. Mom! Let's take a break at the lookout that looks like a shelter. That's a good idea. You can probably see the water that flows into the Bukhangang River if you stand on the wooden bridge in front of the viewing platform. After resting a bit, how about crossing that wooden bridge and walking all the way to the bench near the river? That sounds like a great plan. Oh, Mom! Didn't you say that you applied for experience education? Oh, how time flies. 
If you apply for an expert guide on the Han River Basin Environment Office's Ecological Experience website, you can learn about Supalo Yangsiri from an expert guide. And they also have tailored content for all age groups for those who want non-face-to-face -face guidance. Now, shall we go meet our guide? Yes, let's go!